Let's now trace Lady Justice Philomena Mwilu's 34 years in the legal profession. Uh, Lady Justice Philomena Mwilu graduated in 1984 from the University of Nairobi with a law degree and was admitted to the bar in the same year. Uh, in 1984 to 1991, she began her career serving uh, or working in the Mudoga and Gaturu, Mudoga Gaturu and Company Advocates, later moved to Mutunga and Company Advocates. In 1991 to 1997, she served uh, as a senior legal manager uh, for the Jubilee Insurance Company Limited. After that, 1999 to 2001, she served as a board secretary, electricity regulatory uh, board. Again, in, 19, in 2007, she served as a director, or appointed director, the Nairobi Water and Sewerage Company. She then moved uh, to the judiciary, joining it in 2007, that same year. Uh, first, uh, working as a judge of the commercial division of the High Court, and then uh, the High Court in Eldoret. She came back to Nairobi in 2011, transferred to the criminal divisions of the High Court. And after that, uh, in 2012, she headed the Environment and Land Division. She was then, or she moved then to the Appellate Court in 2012, uh, November, being elevated to the Court of Appeal. Uh, in 2016, this is when everybody now knew who Philomena uh, Mwilu was, the Justice, nominated uh, and confirmed as the Deputy Chief Justice, surprising many, beating 14 other candidates to become the Deputy Chief Justice. In 2017, she served uh, she sat for the first time uh, in the presidential election petition in the Supreme Court. And again, she was in that famous, uh, among the first Supreme Court judges, not even among. She was among uh, the first Supreme Court judges to annul the pre ele presidential election of Uhuru Kenyatta. And a lot of controversy, of course, came after that. On 24th of October, 2017, this is very memorable. Justice Mulu's bodyguard was shot and injured. Uh, that was a long, gone road. On 25th, the morning after, Justice Lady Justice Lomona Mulu failed or did not appear uh, for the ruling on the presidential election rerun. We all remember what her boss, Chief Justice Maraga, said when she was trying to explain the whereabouts of the other judges because he came alone saying, you all knew. Uh, what happened last night, that is to Lady Justice Philomena Mwilu's bodyguard. Today, August 28th, she was arrested and charged, we all saw that, of allegations of abuse of office, bribery and failure to pay taxes. She was released on a five million shilling bond, personal bond. That is Philomena Mwilu's 34 years experience in the legal profession.